Hello and welcome to our seasonal special vlog as we prepare for the most wonderful time of the year. The start of the holiday season was marked with our first ever Thanksgiving event. Many of the people we support enjoyed learning about the American holiday, tasting some traditional foods and socialising together. Huge thanks to Kelly Walsh, a Meath family member and supporter who kindly organised the event with staff at Cedar View. Residents also enjoyed a fabulous Elvis comeback special at the end of November. Many thanks to Chris, Elvis impersonator extraordinaire for a much enjoyed evening's entertainment. And as the mercury dropped outside, the people we support enjoyed a snowman themed event at the Hive, a big Christmas disco at the Skill Centre with fabulous resident DJ Sean. We are extremely grateful to generous family members who kindly contributed towards our autumn and seasonal social events and to the fundraised income which enables us to provide these fantastic opportunities for the people we support. While social events and Christmas presents may not be a statutory requirement, we receive no statutory funding for them. We know that they make the world of difference to the lives of the people we support. So thank you for helping us to deliver a Christmas experience that Santa would be proud of. We are also very grateful to family members and supporters from the community who generously donated items for Christmas presents for residents. Huge thanks also to Big Potato Games for their generous donation of board games and to Lint for their donation of chocolate. These will make wonderful gifts for Meath residents. However, despite doing our very best, we also need help to cover the cost of living funding gap we continue to experience. Once again, our fuel bill cannot be met with statutory funding alone and we have therefore launched the Yule Fuel Appeal, which runs until the 8th of January. Donations to the Yule Fuel Appeal will simply help us to keep the vulnerable adults we support warm throughout the winter months. Here's our Head of Fundraising, Lucy Maguda, to explain what we're doing to help ourselves and how you can support us. As with everybody, our fuel bill has increased hugely. Um, we've done all we can to mitigate that. We've done lots of things within and around the Meath to try and reduce our fuel costs as much as we can. So this particular appeal will go directly towards helping us cover the cost of gas and electricity to make sure that we keep the vulnerable people we support warm and cosy this winter. All donations to the Yule Fuel Appeal will make a genuinely positive difference to us as we enable the people we support to enjoy a wonderful Christmas time and to keep warm throughout the cold months ahead. While lots of seasonal fun and trips out await the people we support, once again we stepped into the festive season in our most favourite way, with a splendid carol service at St Clement Danes Church. Thank you to all our supporters and family members who joined us for a spectacular evening at the Meath Carol Concert. It was such a special evening and we are hugely grateful to our supporters who kindly gave speeches, and of course, to the Honourable Artillery Company Band and the choir of St Clement Danes Church. But the Meath Choir stole the show and lit up the church with a sparkling performance. Many thanks indeed to the Meath Choir, choir leader Phoebe, and the members of Godalming and Guildford Jazz Choirs who supported their performance, and to our wonderful staff teams. The carol service was, as always, a much enjoyed and appreciated event which reminds us all at the Meath of the tremendous support that we rely on both at Christmas time and throughout the year. As 2023, another challenging year draws to an end, here's a little look back at some of the things that you, our supporters, have helped Meath residents to enjoy. your support throughout the year and on behalf of all at the Meath we hope that you have yourself a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next year.